We have just arrived at Chatu Chak Market, which I believe is the biggest night market in the world. Um, so many, so many hundreds of thousands of people visit here. There are outdoor stalls, indoor stalls, food stalls, clothes, everything that you could want in a market. And we're gonna explore and try and get some bargains. further and further in now just everywhere you look something different a different stall um, it's great I believe it is the biggest in the world so hopefully we can find some things but we don't want to spend too much money and we don't have a lot of space in our bags we've got to be careful and savvy feel nice. but what if you have something small in your bag it'll fall out again picked up some lovely fresh like little mini pancakes they remind me of the ones that you can get in Japan the little fish ones with filling but we're going to see what's inside so we got a few different flavors they're little walnut cookies a hundred baht for ten and you get one extra so let's try this one <laughs> peanut butter very good picked up our first proper bike. Aiden's hot and sweating. Definitely something at indoor or outdoor markets. It's just so hot. There's so many people kind of just all around. But we've picked up our first buy, 20 baht, for a nice little scrunchie. We have just picked up some of these really beautiful handmade vintage signs for my parents behind us. It was 180 for one or two for 300. Look, there he is trying to get in the video. <laughs> but they have a nice outdoor bar, so we think those signs will look great in it. And next to us we have some baby octopus, <laughs> which is not for us. We do not like fish or any seafood. But I'm seeing some fried banana that I like the look of and some lovely, lovely drinks as well. We've just got ourselves some snacks, some fried banana. Look how much is there. 50 baht and Aiden. corn dog, 49 baht. <laughs> very cheap indeed, we like it. So we bought this little weird cat thing. I don't know why, it just looks very funny. And it was 45 baht, so that's very cheap. And a bit of banter, really. It is getting hot, hot, very hot, hot now. Hot. It's about 1pm, um, so a lot busier. We read online that it's best to get here as early as possible. It opens around 8am, I heard, for most visitors. So if you get here around about 9, it's going to be a lot quieter and not as hot, which is much better if you really want to get in and find some bargains. But for us, we're just slowly walking around. We bought a few things, but still on budget. And of course, to cool down, oh, crying child. 
cool down a Taiwan milk tea with the bubbles. Absolutely love it. So refreshing, so tasty and only 35 baht. We are melting, we are sweaty, our legs are tired from walking. But we keep going. We still haven't seen probably even half of it. I don't think, what do you think, Aiden? I don't think you could even see half of it if you wanted to. It's absolutely massive here. It's great. nice 30 degrees we are walking absolutely dying in the heat about to get hotter as well we are carrying on this video by heading to some more markets just some local ones in the center of Bangkok because we are on the lookout for a hat two things <laughs> three things a three hat, things souvenirs and maybe a watch for myself <laughs> So we have a budget of 2,000 baht, which is just under 50 British pounds. I don't want to spend all of that, no. so... Hopefully we don't have to. And I to. definitely don't want to go over it, so let's see. smart with his new watch and how much was it? it was 700 baht. It was originally 850 but I managed to get him down to 700. Some and good then, bargaining. Yeah and then he fixed Jamie's glasses for free. Because so <laughs> they were a guy. bit wonky so Hello. yeah very good. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I just secured myself some new shorts because I've uh, lost them or something, I don't really know. It was 120 baht, so very cheap and uh, I'm happy to pay that. So we're just walking down this uh, market on the street and look at the view in the background, just the massive pagoda, that is amazing. together. <laughs> these were 15 baht each and these were 10 baht each so pretty cheap lunch baht for a little bit of food yeah and they taste delicious <laughs> haven't even really made it to the street that we were going to with all the markets and it seems that we've bought everything that we needed. Aiden's got his new hat, what do we think? I like it, it's a bit tight on my head but maybe I'll stretch it. <laughs> He's got a big head. So comment down below if you like Aiden's new hat <laughs> and anyone that says women do more shopping than men, it is not true. Aiden's got a new watch, a new hat, some new shorts, he's spending all our money and I have nothing, nothing at all. So I have spent half of our budget already, so <laughs> all we need now is some souvenirs, so we're just going to walk around and see what we can find. We have now made it to Khao San Road, which is very different in the daytime. There's lots of market stalls and you can have a look at them. Um, not too busy, which is much better. It's very, very different at night time. Oh, look at 
those pair of shorts. Look, you got a nice fly design on them. Oh wait, that's a real fly. <laughs> not up for a bargain at all. We've got some postcards, some fridge magnets and a little can opener. So I'm happy. I love picking up souvenirs. I don't know why I can't help it. In every country we go to, I have a different thing that reminds me of that country and I really, really enjoy that. Just having a little memento. <laughs> we are officially out of money. <laughs> so what I thought was going to be a quick buying a few things turned into a shopping spree for Aiden. For me, yes. New sunglasses, new hat, new <laughs> shorts, everything. Uh, no money left. So that is pretty much the end of the video. So we spent 1,400 baht on a ha <laughs> this hat, these sunglasses, this watch, some shorts, some souvenirs. Fridge magnets. Yeah. <laughs> and Aiden just went into a shop and sneakily bought me a Christmas present. <laughs> so I can't wait to find out what that is. But that is the end of the video, unfortunately. <laughs> Thank you for watching the video. We will see you in the next one. Remember to like, comment, subscribe to help support us and our channel. We'll see you soon. Bye. <laughs>